Hey Bloodhounds, my name is Eileen Buna and I am running to be your next Executive Secretary for the 2020-2021 to school year. I'm running for this position because students deserve someone who is not only transparent and inclusive with their students, but also honest with them. Someone who will work to ensure that the class of 2021 is having a great final year that caters to their needs and wants to the best of their ability, and someone who is ready for feedback as to how to better advocate for students. And I'm certain that I am the best candidate possible to carry out these roles. Thank you. Some of the ways that I would ensure that my role as guardian of transparency of student council is in being outweighed by commencement activity planning is by increasing communication between the student body and student council. So this includes announcing when meeting minutes are available to the student body, knowing where you can access them. Meeting minutes are a record kept of everything that is said in student council meetings throughout the semester. And this is available in the meeting minutes library on the Google Drive. Opening communication channels, um, knowing who your representatives are and where else you can get answers besides just executives. Trusting our committee members. Uh, this just ensures that these are the right people to piece together a final product that caters to the needs and wants of the seniors and ensures that I can then assign individual tasks and equally distribute work among them. Also just sharing plans and results with the student body, knowing what has and hasn't been worked on. I know it's hard to reveal sometimes that something hasn't been worked on or hasn't made a lot of progress. However, keeping students in the loop every step of the way definitely ensures um, that they are grounded in terms of uncertainty like the one that we're facing now. Hi Bloodhounds, my name is Amber Rivero and I'm running for student council president for 2020-2021 at John Jay College. It would be an honor to represent, advocate, and work alongside all John Jay students and leadership to foster the best student life that we can see here for our future on campus. I would love to be an advocate and fight tirelessly for inclusivity, equality, and a safe space for all students across the campus. Vote for me to be your fierce justice advocate. John Jay is full of amazing students with many different identities, intersectionalities, and experiences that they bring to our diverse community. It's important for any student leader who wants to represent our student body to be inclusive and to understand what advocating for inclusivity across the campus looks like for all students at John Jay. I would continue to create an inclusive campus for all students, no matter their race, ethnicity, religious background, political ideologies, ability, status, or gender orientation. It's extremely important to me that every student at John Jay have a welcome and safe space, that all programs and access to resources are equal across the campus, no matter what identity or intersectionality a student identifies with. And if elected student council president, I would ensure that all students would feel inclusive and advocate for inclusivity for every student at John Jay. You should be welcome here. Hi there, my name is Andrew Brzezanski and I'm running for VP of Student Council. At a time when students need to be activists and to have a council that um, empowers them to do so, we need a VP that um, appoints those students. And I believe that I can and will be that VP. And I'm running on voter awareness, transparency, inclusivity, student awareness, and student activism. So if you're interested, please follow Andrew for VEEP. Thanks. As you may know, the VP chairs the Student Representation Committee. This committee basically appoints people to various vacancies, such as um, whether they're representatives or whether they're committees. And so one way of going about making sure that we not only have the most um, capable and qualified students, but the most diverse students is by making sure that we have the most energetic and passionate uh, students on council. And we have to make sure that um, those students um, are like in those interviews that we do that they are serious about advocating for their sense of justice that they are um, serious about advocating for student justice whatever that means right and so I believe that that is the most effective way to uh, bring a new kind of diversity to student council that we've never seen before thanks my name is Carlos Hines and I'm running for student council president. If you're looking for change on this campus, I'm your guy. What I'm looking to do is make student life better. I am dependable, I'm trustworthy, I'm authentic, and above all, I'm a student just like you are. Let's join this race together and change John Jay for the better. My name is Carlos Hines. I'm running for president of student council. Your choice for change. What makes John Jay exceptional are our bonds that hold together the most diverse college within the CUNY system. 
I believe it doesn't matter who you are or where you come from or what you look like or who you love or what God you chose to worship. It doesn't matter whether you're black or white, Hispanic, Asian or Native American or young or old or rich or poor, abled or disabled, gay, straight or trans, you are welcome to join my administration if you are willing to serve without neglecting any group on our campus. I can assure you that my commitment to a more diverse faculty and student council is my chief priority as president. I want equal parts of our diversity to be reflective in my administration. I hope that you will join me in making this council the most diverse in the history of John Jay. My name is Carlos Hines and I'm running for student council president. My name is Jillian Oyola. I am currently a transfer peer success coach and I am also the treasurer of the Latin American Student Organization with about a year and a half of previous treasury experience at my previous institution. I'm running for student council treasurer because I believe that students should be more aware of where their student activities are being allocated and also to give a voice to every student on campus of where they believe the money should also be allocated. When I think of the student council budget, a lot of the times I think students, students, students. What would students want? What would they need? Um, with my previous positions that I've mentioned, a lot of times students come to me with a lot of financial discrepancies, a lot of issues with paying for tuition, knowing how to close that gap, a lot of holds on their account because they can't afford $500, $1,000 to close their account properly and pay for their classes. So one thing that I'm really passionate about is adding more money to the student council scholarships that we have um, and possibly raising them $1,000, $500, something so that students can apply for these scholarships and get more money and be able to close that gap and maybe have something over to actually pay for things like groceries, metro cards, or anything like that, because that's what matters for students. Hello, my name is Saeed Balam. I'm running to be your next student council treasurer. Currently, I'm the alternate USS delegate and the alternate college council large representative. The reason why I'm running for, for this position is because I'm to increase the transparency between student council and the student body by providing students a voice on how our the student council budget should be allocated in the best interest and needs of our student body. So vote for me and I'll make a difference. Action speaks louder than words. Since Student Council receives $300,000 from the Student Activity Association, I am to make sure that the money is being properly allocated that best suit the interests and needs of our student body. As the chairperson of Committee on Budget, my first priority is to bridge the gap between club role and student council by reactivating the club planning committee so club organizations receive proper funding and they can apply for surplus. My second priority is to purchase more tables and chairs so students have more room to sit on campus. My third priority is to create a sponsorship with the Wellness Center by purchasing more metric cards and food vouchers since a number of our students cannot afford to pay for a metro card and a number of our students encounter food insecurity. My fourth priority is to fund for social justice holidays to recognize the different communities at John Jay College. So please vote for me and I'll make a difference. Hey Bloodhounds, my name is Tavon Pearson. I'm running for Vice President of Student Council as well as University Student Senate Representative. I am a transfer student in my second semester at John Jay College. One of the reasons that I'm running for council is because I have been fortunate enough to have mentorship and guidance throughout my academic career. Unfortunately, many students at John Jay have expressed to me that this is not the case for them. I want to help improve services, create policies and provide a sense of community for students that help empower and ultimately facilitate student academic success. As a black male who identifies as queer and also has invisible disability, I understand the importance of representation. I see John Jay's diversity every time I walk through the hallways. It is going to be my administration's number one priority to make sure that our council represents that very diversity. And in order for us to do that, the nom my nominees for the permanent committee on student representation have to reflect that very diversity. And together we will choose the strongest student council. I see the struggles of students with disabilities. I see the struggles of transfer students not being offered as much support as freshmen. I see the struggles of 
those students who are food insecure. I see those struggles of students who are paying out of pocket. It is our job to make sure that we reflect all of these issues so that we can represent them in the best way possible. What's up, Bloodhounds? It's Yusuf here with Team Rise Above. I want to inform you all about the new inclusion plan that I have been working on. John Jay is one of the most diverse CUNYs and a big part of serving our students is being able to reach them. I'm committed to diversity, equity, and inclusion, both in principle and in practice. In addition to me currently having a diverse campaign team, I'll work with the executive branch to ensure that at least 50% of all student council members, including all appointed positions, are women. I understand that women's voice is underrepresented. We as students have unique lives that make it challenging for us to serve in student leadership and student council, whether that's family, work, or even class scheduling. By providing a stipend for all our representatives, we will lessen the burden of those students who wish to serve the students of John Jay in this capacity. In order to increase the appeal of student government and incentivize students to be, become engaged, I will shift our messaging to appeal to what students truly believe in and galvanize student participation by fighting for what we want. Yuri, salam alaikum, ola, what's up, bloodhounds? It's Yusuf. What makes me qualified to be your president is my work at Integrate NYC, where I fought relentlessly for educational equity in New York City schools. Yeah. I also have experience rallying for local, city, and state issues. My campaign initiatives include inclusivity, mentorship, and tuition costs. No matter the outcome, I vow to amplify your voice. Please visit my Instagram page at riseabove underscore 2020 campaign to learn more about me and my platform.